Hey guys, Noah here coming at you with another video. I am very, very, very excited right now. It's been two weeks. Um, I told you guys I'll be back in mid-August, and it's mid-August, August 12th, so um hmm. Anyway, um I'll just get on to this video. Um I am very, very, very excited right now um to be making a video for you guys, and it's gonna be about our season predictions for the Panthers. So I mean, let's get started. Um hmm. So first, um hmm. We have 55 days left till opening night in Tampa Bay um, against the Lightning. Um, oh yeah, I mean, I can't even believe the last video, I believe it was like 70 days and 15 days later, it's fi it's 55. So guys, it's it's very, very, it's it's coming guys, it's coming. October 6th is coming. But anyway, um, hmm. let's just like, I'm just really going to talk to you guys like what are, like if we make the playoffs or not, that's probably going to be like the main thing for this video. So alright, so first of all, um, hmm. We lost four key players last year. We lost Yager, Smith, Jokinen, and Marcisol. All right, all four key players. Um, again, Jokinen and Smith didn't have their best seasons last season. In my personal opinion, the fifteen sixteen seasons were much better for them. Well, it was really much better for all of the of them except for Trocheck, I believe. But anyway, um. Hmm. And we lost um, Yarmir Yager, and I'm really surprised nobody's signing him yet. I mean, I was thinking maybe by now somebody should sign him, but no, that's not the case. But yeah, but anyway, um, Jonathan Marshall, and th that was the probably our the one that really hit us because he's a 30 goal scorer. He's proven himself, and we just let let him go to the Vegas Golden Knights. So I mean, that's that, and we and we also lost some. And we also lost some um, Red Obera, Kyle Rabb, Scarbosa. Um, we lost a couple um, good players too, but I mean, they're not as key as like Marshall or Smith. But anyway, um, hmm. so that's who we lost, and we gained a couple good players. We got um, Evgeny Dadnoff and Redeem Verbata, the main two we got, um, and Michael Haley, which is like a, a replacement of Sean Thornton, um, which. He retired, but anyway, um, hmm. yeah, I just want to see this like, oh no, it's too dark. But anyway, um, hmm. that's that. So personally, um, we don't really have any like, depends. We don't really have any like. I mean, all right. And what I'm trying to say is like, people on Twitter are saying, um, hmm. Now I'm even saying this to it. It feels like we haven't had like those types of draft picks like McDavid, Crosby, Ovechkin, fit all 50 goal scorers at least, well, 40 goal scorers at least, but. And we haven't really had that. I mean, that's the thing. I mean, we have, like, players like Barkov, Huberdo, Trocek. They're under 25 years old, and they and they have to be the leaders of his team. Because, in, in my personal opinion, McKenzie's not getting any ice time. So, I don't really, like, I mean, yeah, in my personal opinion, like I said in my previous vid videos, the, the captain should be on the first or, or second line. That's not the case for the Panthers. But yeah, that's really that. So really, we we basically have our younger guys taking the role of this team, and I would, and I don't personally like that because last year we had Yarmir Yager who did that, and there wasn't like really like I mean it was I don't know it's and it feels like we don't have any like goal scorers. I mean I'll probably say our goal scorers not right now. I mean I'm just being honest, probably redeemed for bad. Nobody else could probably get past that 25 mark. I mean. Do you think I think they can? Yes, they could. But do you think they will? No. I mean, do I think they will? No. I'm I'm sorry. I mean, I've been positive all last year, year before, and just not well year before. But I've been positive all last year. Nothing has happened. Nothing. Nothing. So do I think we'll make the playoffs? Is this a playoff team? No. I'm I'm sorry, Panther fans. No, I I do not think the Panthers would make the playoffs. So I think we'll. But on the other hand, do you, do I think we'll have a better season than last year? Yes. I mean, of course we could have a better season than last year. I mean, so I mean, I don't know. And my next thing too is personally with um hmm, this goaltending thing. If if Luongo does not at least play 50 games this season, there's no way we're going to make the playoffs. I don't. I do not think Reimer could hold the potential of starting because I don't know because in my personal opinion they have like. Personally, no, none of them had their best seasons last year, but I think Luongo is way better than Reimer in that key, like, position. Like, I mean, I, like, with his goals against average, save percentage, even though Reimer had better statistics in, on that mark last season, I really think Luongo should start next season. Who cares about his age? I mean, he's still 
a legend. He's a great goaltender. And Reimer's a good goaltender too, but I'll, I don't think he should start, all right? So, I mean, that's really what I have to say. I mean, maybe, and I don't know. I was even thinking about this too. I mean, you never know. I mean, the Panthers could go after, like, I mean, you know, I believe like a few months ago they were saying like Ovechkin possibly. Like, okay, I don't know where these people, people get this get these things from I mean they have like no sources none of that stuff I mean some of them do some of them don't but I mean anyway um yeah sorry Panthers fans I do not think the Panthers would make the pl playoffs but hey look I'm just a fan I'm not an expert so I mean I could get proven wrong any time now so I mean don't take this video too personal all right see you guys um and I might do some future line of vi video I don't know when maybe like in the, in the, in the next few days but anyway, um, that's that. All right, bye, guys. See you later.